Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So, like the title says, today I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to get all of the 350 million download celebration Purunga Dragon Balls so that you guys can summon Purunga, make your wishes, and uh, reap all of the awesome rewards. Now, this time around, we have three sets of Dragon Balls for 21 balls in total. So with that said, let's uh, scroll down a little bit here. And as you can see, we have the first set of balls, the second set of balls, and the third set of balls. And after you complete each set, you're able to summon Purunga, make three wishes, and then repeat the process three times in total. So starting with the first set, in this column, we have the condition for how to acquire the Dragon Ball. And then in this column, we have the date that each ball first becomes available. So in case this is your first ever uh, Purungo Dragon Ball campaign, the way this works is that starting from the uh, first day of the campaign, which was, you know, August 26th, which is actually today, one new ball will become available until the end of the campaign. So for example, right now, while I'm filming this video, we can only acquire the one star Dragon Ball for the first set, and then tomorrow, on the 27th, the 2-star ball will become available. And then the day after that, on August 28th, the 3-star ball will be available, and so on and so forth. Okay, so definitely keep that in mind. But starting with the 1-star ball, which like I said, is available now, the condition is that you have to clear Stage 1 of the Legend of the Super Saiyan or Emperor's Intentions on any difficulty. So these are the two new story events from the 300 and 50 million dollars celebration, so just clear stage one of either uh, event, and then you'll get the one star Dragon Ball. And then for the two star ball, which is available on August 27th, 2021, you have to perform a Z Awakening. So very simple, just Z Awaken any unit, and you'll get that two star ball. And then for the three star ball, which is available on August 28th, 2021, you have to consume at least 77 stamina, so just do any event that requires stamina until you use up to 77 and you'll get that ball. And then for the 4 star Dragon Ball, which is available on August 29th, 2021, you have to equip a skill orb. Uh, pretty simple, so go into the hidden potential and give a skill orb to any of your units and you'll get the 4 star ball. And then for the 5 star Dragon Ball, which is available on August 30th, 2021, collect at least 7 int key spheres and clear a stage. And you can do any stage you want, so jump into like story mode or whatever, and then maybe bring like an orb changing item, like uh, a Puar or an orb changing unit, and then get your seven int key spheres, clear the stage, and you'll get that ball. And then for the six star Dragon Ball, available on August 31st, 2021, clear a stage with a team made up of characters from the same type. So a mono team, uh, all int, all Fizz, all STR, whatever you want to do, and then clear any stage, and you'll get the 6-star ball. And finally, for the 7-star Dragon Ball of the first set, available on September 1st, 2021, you have to clear a stage with a team made up of only fusion category characters. So a all fusion category team, uh, maybe led by Gogeta or whoever else you have as leader, and then uh, clear any stage, you get that ball, and you will have completed the first set of Purunga Dragon Balls. And then after that, you can summon Purunga and make your wishes. And uh, we will take a look at the wishes a little bit later in the video after we go through all the clues here. So for the second set, once you're finished the first set, you can start collecting the second set. And for the one star ball for the second set, which is available on September 2nd, 2021, you have to clear a stage with a team made up of only Ginyu Force category characters. And obviously, uh, you have to get the free to play Ginyu Force units first. So um, if you haven't done that, then I guess get to work, get your Ginyu Force units, and then clear a stage. You get the one star ball for the two star ball of the second set, available on September 3rd, 2021. Use a support memory. So do that, right? Go into a stage, make sure you have a support memory set and you have to make sure the support memory actually goes off, I'm pretty sure. And then you get that 2-star ball, or the 3-star ball of the second set, available on September 4th, 2021. 
collect at least seven AGL key spheres and clear a stage. So just like the other one, uh, either bring a orb changing item or a unit that can change AGL key spheres, get at least seven, clear the stage, and you're good. And then for the four star Dragon Ball available on September 5th, 2021, clear a stage within one minute. So go into an event where you know you can clear it pretty quick. Uh, the um, that Namek Saga uh, event with like the Krillin and the Gohan is pretty simple. So maybe do that one and then clear it, get your four star ball. And then for the five star Dragon Ball available on September 6th, 2021, perform a friend summon, do that, get the ball. And then for the six star Dragon Ball available on September 7th, 2021, purchase goods at Baba's shop with trade points at least once. So buy anything you want, maybe some support items, maybe some uh, of those support memory films or whatever, and then you're good to go. And for the seven star Dragon Ball of the second set, which will be available on September 8th, 2021, you have to clear a stage with a team made up of fusion characters. So it looks like it's the exact same mission for the seven star ball for both the first set and the second set. So uh, once again, build your fusion team, all fusion team, clear a stage, and you're going to be done for the second set. And then you can summon Purunga again, make three more wishes, and then start collecting the third set of Purunga Dragon Balls. So starting with the one star ball for the third set, which is available on September 9th, 2021, you have to recruit clever and rational staff Zarbon, which is the new free to play Zarbon. And uh, I'm not sure if you'll just automatically get the ball if this guy is already in your box or if you have to just like do the stage again and get another copy. So if you don't get the ball automatically, then run the stage where you can, uh, you know, get this guy and then you should be able to get that one star ball. And then for the two star Dragon Ball of the third set, available on September 10th, 2021, Dokken Awaken, a character. For the three star ball of the third set, available on September 11th, 2021, level up a character's super attack. So for this one, you can either use a Kai or just use a dupe for, you know, the same character and uh, level up their super attack. And then you'll be good to go for the third ball or the three star ball. And then for the four star ball of the third set, available on September 12th, 2021, clear a stage using the frog support item. And this guy is uh, this item right here. And you can get them from either the Genius Bulma's Battle Prep, which is not currently live, but you can also get it from the Fearsome Ginyu Force event. So get yourself some frog support items, use one of them in a stage, and you should be able to get that uh, four-star Dragon Ball. And then for the five-star Dragon Ball, which is, uh, which is available on September 13th, 2021, clear a stage with a team that includes all of five types or includes allies of five types. So a rainbow team, so your team has to have at least one Fizz, one AGL, one STR, one Int, and one Tech, and then you'll be able to get the five-star ball. And then for the six-star Dragon Ball, which is available on September 14th, 2021, level up a character's Link skill. So build whatever team you want, jump into, uh, I would recommend stage 23-8 of the st story mode or quest mode. And then as long as you get one character link level to increase, then uh, after you finish the stage, the six star ball should pop up. And finally, for the seven star Dragon Ball, for the third and final set, available on September 15th, 2021, tap the special banner on the home screen. So go to your main screen where you have like your character wheel or your wallpaper. And then at the bottom, you have those like little banners that are scrolling by, right? So uh, the first banner should be the special banner. It should have like some stars or some kind of special design on it that you usually don't see. Click on that and then uh, it'll give you the ball. If it's not the first one, then just scroll through it and you'll eventually find one that looks different from the other ones. Click on that and you'll get that seven star Dragon Ball. You can summon Purunga for the third time, make your wishes and that's it, you'll be done. So taking a quick look at these wishes, the first wish is I want more allies, which gives you seven 350 million download celebration tickets. 
Uh, the second one is I want to power up super attacks and you get three of each Grand Kai. For the third one, we have I want to activate hidden potential so you get a bunch of uh, hidden potential orbs for each type as well as five reversal medals. And then this one is I want a full belly which gives you some meat, one large, five medium, and 15 small for stamina of course. And then this one is I want to attempt lots of events. You get 100 green story keys, 100 black keys, and then 30 of the red ones. And then this one is I want treasures and support items. So 777 treasure, uh, what's it called again? Incredible, incredible gems. You get 30 of uh, the support items and then 20 of the nuking support items. And this one is I want to strengthen allies. So you'll be getting a bunch of Hercule statues, which I believe add up to, uh, let's see. So it's 300, or sorry, sorry, 35 million here, right? And then it's, uh, 15 million here. So 50 million, 50 million zenny for the Hercule statues, and then a bunch of awakening medals, a bunch of awakening or training items rather, and some training locations. So the choice is ultimately up to you. As I said, man, you can choose three wishes each time for a total of nine wishes. And I'll probably be going for the meats because the stamina is always good, the hidden potential orbs, and also the Kai's, because Kai's are always useful, right? Kai's, orbs, and stamina are always going to be things you need. So I'll probably go for those three. If you guys want the tickets, um, not a terrible choice, but obviously it's not like super likely you'll get something useful, but you could get something really good. So if you want to do more summons, that's an okay choice in my opinion. And uh, of course, the other stuff's good too, man. Like strengthening allies, you're getting like a good amount of zenny. You're getting a bunch of medals and training items and locations. So that's also pretty good value. Um, this one, uh, incredible gems you can always farm, but 777 is actually a lot. So it'll save you quite a bit of time if you guys especially are, uh, you know, needing to buy a bunch of stuff in the Baba Shop with incredible gems. This will definitely uh, save you from some farming. And uh, of course, story keys can also be useful too, but it depends on like if you usually keep up with like events that go live, if you do, if you usually are the kind of person that like does everything when they first come out, then you probably won't need these keys as much. So uh, it depends on the kind of player you are, I guess. But uh, that's it guys, that is today's video. Those are the wishes, those are all the ways to get each of the Primeval Dragon Balls for all three sets. As I said, one new ball becomes available every day from the first day of the campaign, which is the 26th. So if you can't get a certain ball, just check the date. It might be just because, you know, that ball isn't available yet, right? And uh, that's it, guys. That's the video. Hopefully this helps some of you guys out there. And uh, as always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here until next time. Hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.